Hey guys, this is an introduction to Motino, a low-cost wireless Arduino clone that I designed for my own projects, but since some people started asking about it, uh, I decided to try to make it available to others. Uh, some time ago I started to think of how I could build a simple network of Arduino nodes for environmental data harvesting and home automation, but I wasn't really happy with the existing solutions because they were either not the right size, uh, not battery friendly, or I had to hand solder the kits to keep costs low. Ethernet shields were also quite expensive and running wires around the house for those was out of the question. So that's how Motino was born. Uh, it's based on the Atmega 320AP and it has all the pins exposed on the two side headers here. Uh, it runs at 16 megahertz, 3.3 uh, volts. On the bottom it has this RFM12B transceiver footprint uh, which is an excellent choice uh, or alternative to Zigbee radios uh, which are at least three times more expensive uh, than the RFM12B. And I know there's many similar Arduino clones out there that have uh, comparable specs. However, most of these Arduino clones are either somewhat overpriced, uh, they're bulky, or like I said, you have to hand solder them, which is fun for learning how to solder, but it's kind of time consuming when you just need a bunch of these assembled. So uh, if you need 20 or 30 wireless Arduino nodes, the time and money you spend with, the, with some of the existing solutions can really pile up. So here are some of the highlights of the Motino. It's a low cost Arduino clone fully compatible with the Arduino IDE. Uh, it's designed for very low power battery operation. Uh, the wireless version includes this RFM12B uh, transceiver and a wire antenna. It's very small, it's just 1.3 inch by 0 0.9 inch. It's, uh, the, the layout of the headers are breadboard friendly, uh, so you can attach uh, female headers on the bottom or on top, or male headers if you just want to use it on the breadboard for prototyping. Uh, it has this uh, FTDI header for easy programming directly from the Arduino IDE and you just need a, a FTDI adapter for that. Those are uh, easy to find and are cheap. It uh, has a LED on board for debugging or visual indication. And the real attractive point for this is uh, it's uh, very low cost. It, a standalone version that doesn't include the radio is just around 10 to $12. I'm not sure yet and uh, the version that includes the radio, the wireless version, is around $16 uh, fully assembled. So uh, there you go. The onboard radio can act as a transmitter or receiver and uh, I prefer the 434 megahertz version because it has the uh, better indoor range and quite good wall penetration. But nothing stops you, for you from using the 915 megahertz version if you're in the US. Uh, I guess if you're in Europe, uh, the only legal band over there is the 868 MHz uh, version of the radio. So uh, this is my first revision of the Motino and I still have some minor tweaks that I want to make. Uh, but I'll post updates as soon as I have them. So uh, let me know what you think and uh, thank you for watching.